Hello and welcome to Let's Play Atari 2600, and this, as you can tell, is Alien from also 1982. Uh, no, this isn't Pac-Man. No, 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 this has nothing to do with Pac-Man, does it? Uh, can we start? How do we start here? Like that? No, like that. Like that, I think. There we go. This is, once again, this has nothing to do with Pac-Man. I think these things up here are eggs. Oh no, those things... Whoa! Good grief! Yeah, that's my... Ah! Flamethrower. Uh, am I playing on... I think I'm playing on a hard level here. Whoa! I was never very good at Pac-Man, which kind of... Whoa, why are they going so freaking fast? Well, I might have to play a little slower level. <laughs> No, this has nothing to do with Pac-Man at all. Ah. High, highly advanced graphics error! Ah! Oh yeah, I forgot I have a flamethrower. Uh, what level am I playing here? Let's try that again. When I push the jump, that's a flamethrower. It scares them, because... Aliens are scared of flamethrowers. If I'd remember that... Oh! Wow, that didn't scare him. Oh, is that more flame? Haha. <gasps> -ha. Boy, that sure does... Am I, like, on a super advanced level here or something? But once again, this has nothing to do with Pac-Man. This is a completely different game. Based on a completely different premise. Ah! Now that was cheap. That was just cheap. Oh, God, what am I doing over here? Boy, after eight hours of this, I would be ready for the nut house, I think. Ah! No! <laughs> what? Come on, what level am I playing here? There, let's try it. Oh. Is that how many little people I have down the bottom? Uh, four? Sure. There we go. That's more my level. Not like we've missed anything, but uh, these little dots, I don't know what they are. Whatever they are, it's worth risking our life running around in a Stromo spaceship. Oh, that's why I am not an astronaut. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna say that little egg or <laughs> pulsar, I'm not sure what. Oh, okay, okay, that's it, that's it. If you read the instructions, these dots are actually eggs. <laughs> Square eggs, and I assume that's... There we go. Ah! Oh! I have no idea what just happened. But whatever happened... I think I just got him. Yeah, kind of like another game that begins with P. That has nothing to do with this game. That makes those little aliens vulnerable. Actually, whoa, what the? Uh, what? This is like a bonus level? Oh my god. Uh, okay, we'll just pretend that didn't happen. I'm not sure if I was hallucinating or not, but, uh, and this here is a hyperspace tunnel. Yes, a hyperspace tunnel. You see, I kind of turn into a vapor and go into hyperspace. Extremely satisfying to play this game. Actually, this is a game I don't remember too well from when I was a kid. Obviously, that's probably no great loss. Let me get some more eggs, and the eggs change color because I don't know if they're gonna hatch or something. Ah! Ah! Back away! That, my friend. Okay, I'm gonna try this now. I'm gonna get this. Ah, oh, God! Are you kidding me? I can't go left and right. Yes, the excitement mounts again. As we get square eggs, and, uh... Let me try my flamethrower on this guy. Can I actually cook him? Well, I don't know if I can or not. Oh, I'll try him. No, you can't cook them. I don't know what that is. I got points for it. 
And now I'm orange. Look at the flamethrower, the mighty flamethrower of death. Of death. Whoa! I was in hyperspace there for a second. <laughs> Amazing sounds. Ah. It's actually hurting my fingers. Um. I guess I can only, only use that flame to, ooh, for a little bit at a time. Alright, I'm gonna do this now. I'm gonna get this. This is really making me mad. Come on! As you can see, the variety in the maze is just mind-blowing. It's just so different every time. It really is quite amazing, and it adds for so many challenges. Oh, Ripley, help me! Ripley! I'm surrounded by aliens, I'm in hyperspace now, and I'm stepping on eggs. Because there's eggs everywhere, and aliens come out of the eggs, even though there's only four aliens at any one time. Whoa, but there's three. I was only three. Well, whoa! Oh, I still got one more. Okay. This is really starting to annoy me. I'm gonna do this level now. God, they come out of the side so fast. Ha! Ah! What? What? <laughs> oh, boy. Okay, those, those are my lives down there. Those things down there to the left are actually me, even though it looks like a fork. And this is, yeah, I don't know, Pulsar. Uh, I'm through hyperspace, and I'm eating things, I guess, or something's happening. I got points for that, 16,000 points. I'm a alien killer, I tell you what. If the Earth is ever threatened by things that kind of look like... All right, let's do this. Let's go, let's go, let's go. We just want to see what happens here. Ah, uh, come on! I'm crazy with my flame tower. You aliens die. What happened there? Something good happened there. I'm getting lots of points. Whoa, it's gonna eat me. Woo! <laughs> ah! Fire! Fire is your friend. Oh, God. Is this ever going to end? <laughs> Please tell me 15 minutes is up yet. Whoa. I took a trip through hyperspace there. Um, what's this? Oh, it's a thing. Not one of these other things, but a different thing. Come on, let's do one more level. Am I really just sucky at this game, or... Oh, it, the same. Could somebody please kill me? I want to be eaten by an alien. I think I'd rather be eaten by an alien than play this game. One more time. Could an alien please oblige me and eat me? Whoa! Oh, thank you! Oh, no. <laughs> Could an alien please eat me and put me out of my misery? Thank you. Wow, those were the good old days, weren't they? That was Alien by 20th Century Fox. This is Hank Steelbottom saying a very well-deserved bye-bye.